what's up guys so today i'm going to be showing you how to make uh, add-ons with google drive and so the first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and download this folder now basically you guys if you guys don't know what i'm talking about go ahead and check out my other videos on how to make folders in an add-on and also how to make video add-ons in general uh i'll be linking that below in description also this folder in description as well so go ahead and do that now i'm just going to go straight right into the code and so all the code goes in default.py well not well not everything but most of it edit with notepad now i've already made a folder for live tv it's, i mean again if you guys don't know check out my last video again a folder for a video since we're going to be doing um a google drive video and this is where your image url goes so i just have an image which is a google drive image I don't know if you guys can see that, but I'm just going to go ahead and open that up in Google Chrome. Yep, that's the image that it's going to that it's going to show up. So, uh once you do that, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up Google Drive, make a new folder, which you do by new folder, whatever you name it. In my case, I name it videos. Go ahead and click um uh, right click share advanced options change on public on the web can view not can edit save it done go in and right now i already have three videos in basically you just drag the video in and do whatever you want but drag all the videos that you want in your add-on go ahead and type google drive host slash and paste whatever you copied okay so once you do that now the Cody actually goes ahead and looks in the page source so now what you want to do is you want to um, get this line of code now this line starts um, right here div class div class slash and ends here even though it looks like it's one line it's just a combo up line um, go ahead and this is where your regex goes paste that in don't worry about anything right now go ahead and make sure you don't copy this link because this has view dash source copy this link and paste it in here and also paste it in here as well now you you guys might be asking how does this go to the folder now it says it go to it goes to mode 3 which at the bottom it says mode 3 equals movies that's the um what's it called oh, i forgot the method name um okay so once you paste the link um basically now you want to get the regex now if you guys have seen this is the href or the link now you guys might have noticed that it doesn't start with www now what do you do so simply just don't worry and grab the link that's in href a href and this is basically a meme name of it same thing parentheses dot plus quote now the first thing it takes is video name now this is a variable name make sure it's as close as what you're doing because then later on you ha let's say you have a really complex add-on you don't know what you're doing you don't know what the variables are for it's going to be easier for you because you named them pretty well so it would be uh url now it go it, here it goes video url and name would be uh video name so once you do that make sure that um it's if the ends capital you make it capital u is capital or if you made your variable name capital you make it capital because python is case sensitive uh once you do that now how do you get the link to play because it's a half link what you want to do is you want to put quote a t t p s make sure you put s uh www dot google drive dot com then percent 
%s. Now, percent %s because what it would do is it would connect this URL to that one, and this one already starts with slash. So it would be Google Drive dot com slash host and so basically if you had an extra slash here uh slash here it's not gonna work or in some websites it's not like that there is a slash here but not in the other url that you grab so you guys just gotta learn that and video url because that's that is the thing that we want to connect now here here's where the mistake i made I actually switched it. The first thing is URL. So now uh, problems like those just get frustrating. So name. There we go. The first thing you grab is video URL and then the video name. Go ahead and save it. Done. Done. Make sure you copy the folder. Um if you're on Windows percent or percent app data percent backslash Cody click OK once this comes up go in add-ons and simply just paste whatever the whatever the folder you copied and if you guys don't get this you'll be fine if you do then replace the files in the destination once that happens go ahead and open up Cody um I already have it open because I already tried it before error okay who cares Oh, I do have an error. What the heck is that for? Um, go ahead and open up your Cody folder. Um, once you do that, once you do that, go ahead and open up add-ons. The first add-on, default.py. Now we have an error in this line. Oh. Okay, there it is. It's when you have percent %s, you put percent %variable and click save. Now, you see, small mistakes like these don't make the add-on not work. So, let's go ahead and try it now. I'm pretty sure that's the error. Yep, there it is. Told you. So, Yes, that's the image that we put in. And yes, those are the videos that we put on YouTube, uh, I mean Google Drive. So there you guys have it. There you guys have it. You guys saw it works. So, and that's pretty much it. Uh, I did not mean to click on that again and just want to show you that live TV also works but none of these channels okay so viewer did work but others don't work because viewer already has like one stable link and that's pretty much it now I'm gonna be showing you an easy way like, if you're making your own M3U for yourself, but not actually publishing it in public, but, like, the channels you see every day. So, I'm going to be showing you how to make an M3U for that. So, definitely stick around the channel. And please subscribe, like, and comment for any questions you still have. And I'll answer them if I know them. Yeah.